Hey guys, Tony with One with Survival Tactics. Uh, today I'm just going to go over my off grid calm bag. Alright, and I thought I'd go over what I have in it. It's kind of a mess on the inside because I just got back from uh, uh, winter field day. Alright, but as for the pack, it's just a Walmart, a Walmart pack. Nothing special. Right, so we'll start from the outside here. In this Molly pouch here, first thing we got are two of the components from the Chameleon Impaws antenna. Okay, so got some wire and I can't remember what it's called. It don't really matter. It's part of the Impaws antenna. On the outside we've got the mill whip from the for the Impaws and then the standard whip that comes with the Impaws. The mill whip was an, addition, an additional uh, purchase. Alright, so get into the mess here. Alright, I got my coax cables. Um, I got this. I don't even know what kind it is. All I know is I got them because they're light. Uh, trying to make it a little lighter to pack. About eh, maybe 40 feet counterpoise wire. See if it's in a big mess because I just threw it back in my bag today. All right, this comes with the chameleon antenna impaws, and it's for it's for hanging the antenna. We run the one piece through here, screw it on, and then we can clamp it onto pipe or whatever, and we can turn this. All right, this was a cheap lithium-ion solar char or solar charge controller that I got from uh, I think eBay. Well it's not very expensive but it is for lithium ion batteries and you can see the wires one goes to the solar panel the other one goes to your battery and then this far one here that goes to your radio so pretty simple setup pretty simple setup there As for the radio, it's just a Yasu FT817. It's got uh, an LDG auto tuner. This is actually made for the 817. I cannot remember what the uh, this carrier is off the top of my head. So if I remember, I'll put it in the description. Right. But it mounts to it. We can hook loops to it. And then of course, I think this piece. I ordered this piece also. I think it's called this. Yeah, I can't remember what it's called. Anyway, it holds the uh, tuner on there. So, that's my radio. Alright, Samsung Galaxy Tab. Um, that's what runs my digital programs. Alright, so I've had this a while. It's a Sun Kingdom 26 watt panel. I don't even think you can get this anymore from uh, Amazon, but this is what I use to charge the battery, keep the radio running. Um, I've had absolutely no problem with this solar panel. I used it all last summer in uh, some classes, uh, all week long, no problem. So I'm actually pretty happy with it. And in the inside pocket here, I've got the manual for the Yasu because this thing has a ton of options and settings. Then I've got a waterproof manual also. Then I've got some redundancy. This came with the Chameleon antenna also uh, for another, one good thing about this Chameleon antenna, you can set it up multiple ways. So there's another way we can set it up. I haven't used it yet. All right, I have wire. Let me see here. All right, two bundles of wire. That is for my 40 meter dipole antenna. Uh, 
and a black and a red smaller one that's 20 meter dipole antenna. Probably should do them all in the same color. I didn't. Paracord to tie the dipoles up. The lithium ion battery. This is a 9.8 amp hour battery. More paracord. Tent stakes, because I've got to stake some of the antennas down. Wolfie Link interface. A one to one ballin, QRP ballin. Um, USB cord, because I can also charge that tablet with the charge controller. A wrench to connect for the ballin, and then some connectors. A half spool of tarred bank line for tying off antennas. A multitude of connectors for the solar panel, depending on what I want to charge up. The antenna, so I can, this radio does uh, two and 70 centimeters also, so I can use that for that. Get on the repeaters. Um, this is what I fill this up with some sand or some dirt in my throw sack. Also, there's more tarp bank line. More paracord. <laughs> a little bit more coax. Not really enough to do much with. And then a multi-tool. Alright, so I don't need every bit of this in there. Um, but I got it in there anyway. So, anyway. So I'll go over my comms bag. Alright, thanks guys. This is Tony with Wilma Survival and Tactics. Remember, trade hard today for uncertain tomorrow.